People living in the northwest suburbs are preparing riverfront homes for possible flooding. Take a look at what the Mississippi is doing along stretches of Champlain and Anoka. Large chunks of ice are piling up and preventing the river's natural flow. Bill Hudson is on the scene to explain what's happening. Flooding on the Mississippi River here in Anoka is nothing unusual, of course. It's happened before, unless it's happening in January. Imagine the surprise of residents who awoke to find their cars surrounded by ice and water, victims of a rapid and dramatic rise of the ice-covered Mississippi. So within a 24-hour period, it went up eight feet. Jennifer and Rick Carlson live on the Champlain side of the river, where riverfront paths are closed and underwater. If it keeps that up, um, we could have a wet garage. Blame it all on the river's ice pack. It's breaking up and floating downstream, where it's formed its own ice dam. We Treated. had high water, the ground saturated, and uh, with the freezing temperatures and the ice build up, it causes ice dams and then just backs the water up. That backup's causing the Rum River Dam in Anoka to all but disappear. We have had ice jams in the past. Anoka Police Chief Eric Peterson says city crews are checking vulnerable infrastructure. They have flood supplies on standby. We have plenty of sandbags should we ever need them. However, at this point, it doesn't appear that we're going to have to get to that point where, where we can make, need to make sandbags available to the public. Folks who are used to shoveling snow not pitching sandbags. It comes up eight feet in less than 24 hours. That's a rapid rise. It is, and it's a little scary, but we'll, we'll keep our fingers crossed. The National Weather Service Flood Forecast Center expects the uh, river to crest very shortly and then do a gradual decline. In Anoka, Bill Hudson, WCCO 4 News. Hydrologists say that ice dams normally form during spring floods, and the most severe were back in 1965. That is when dynamite placed from a helicopter blew the dams open.